So now let's start writing simple prompts. So over here, I can ask anything as you can see right here. For example, I can go around and say, uh, like, write something about parts of a computer system right here, just like this and press enter. So once I go around and do that, Copilot will actually give you a response as you can see right here. Like it is giving me a parts of a computer system like computer case, motherboard, central processing unit, graphic card, storage device and power supply unit right here. And it gives reference for whatever it's right, it writes as well. For example, you can see that it took reference from computer in bits and red.geek right here and so forth. So as I go around over here, you can see that it references all of these contents out as well. You can also ask it uh, things like, for example, what is the weather uh, like today in Yangon right here, just like this and press enter. And what happens is that it searches for the weather information right here about Yangon and gives the information about it as well. So you can give like regular information and you can see that this is what you have as well. And that is how you can start writing simple prompts as you can see right here. You can go for a more creative mode if you want it to generate out stories and so forth and more precise, uh, precise if you want it to give a more scientific fact right here. And that is how you can go around and start writing props, uh, prompts and uh, interact with Microsoft Copilot. And as we progress through this tutorial series, we're going to see the different abilities of Microsoft Copilot. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.